125th at F8. That's a story of my life coming from a photographic family. This is the other love in my life. Just love. 1930. Alaskan Persaner. Allowing me to travel with my students from all over the world to the offshore islands off Southern California, the Channel Islands. 1949. I made my first image underwater. Looking up at our day star, the sun. From Anacapa Island, Santa Cruz, Santa Rosa, San Miguel, Catalina, Santa Barbara Island, San Clemente, San Nicolas. And these were my students as I'm looking up recalling the days when my life was so enriched by meeting Spot, a beautiful, beautiful harbor seal, Anacapa Island. She stole my heart and she also stole my snorkel. What a joy, what peace. Santa Barbara Island with Jack Drayful into the 80s. 125th at F8. 8 was my ideal exposure for most of my life within the sea. What a journey it has been. When light and motion brought their camera systems and other pros came, Adam Ravitch, Ron Coley, the USS Peacock of Santa Cruz Island, working with film in the early days of underwater photography. San Salvador Island, doing my first panorama in black and white. And this is another part of my life. This is my family. Here with my daughter, Denise, aboard my submersible we called Snoopy. What a joy. Sue Drayful bringing a sun star into view for both of us to witness. We sailed to the Sea of Cortez many times and the offshore islands off Guadalupe Island of Mexico always looking up. With the Historical Diving Society, Guadalupe Island, photographing the Great White. What a remarkable animal. I love photography, and I love black and white. The shapes, the forms, the highlights, the shadows, the design, the quality the quality of light, the quality of capturing that frozen moment in time when everybody is looking at you for answers about our sea, about our environment, about our planet Earth. And now, in my 80s, I come above water to places like Ocean Geographic's Antarctica the high arctic, the icebergs, the beautiful quality of light and shadow. Creating details in the brightest highlight and in the deepest shadow with movement. And being a photographer, to make a statement about the changing times on our planet with climate change all over the world it's occurring. Oceans are rising. That's the joy of being a photographer and looking up to make a statement about how we feel and how our life has been on earth for all to enjoy no matter what language 
no matter what country. It's a single language, this photography. And mine is about our water planet, the great rivers of the world, the great oceans, and the waterfalls of our earth cascading down to the rivers from the sea. We live in a magnificent planet. It's all about light. It's all about capturing the beautiful moments in your life. And now we go our separate ways. Thank you for inviting me here to be with you. Bless you. Ernie Brooks.